Today, you're filling out these doodle notes and enhancing them to go into your notebook. They are a review of the states of matter, also known as the phases of matter, and their changes. You will go through this video to fill it out. Within matter, atoms are constantly in motion. The movement of atoms determines the substance's current state, such as the solid that vibrates, the liquid that slides, and the gas that zooms. We'll start with the gas. The size, or the volume, changes. It can get bigger or smaller. Shape changes by the container with lots of free space between particles. That makes them compressible, a unique property. Particles flow past one another. Now for liquids. A liquid keeps its size, its volume. The shape changes by the container as seen with this video. You'll see the water changes the shape from the measuring cup to the shape of the brain. In a liquid, the particles slide past one another. As for a solid, it will keep its volume. When moved, it keeps its shape. The particles are considered rigid, meaning there's no flow, a fixed pattern. Now let's look at the phase changes, the arrows on either side of your paper. Remember, when a substance changes phase, it retains its chemical identity. It's a physical change. A phase change will occur at different temperatures as you are adding or removing thermal energy, changing how quickly the particles are moving. When thermal energy is removed from a gas, the particles slow down and condensation occurs. As you continue to remove thermal energy from the liquid, the particles continue to slow down and freezing occurs. From the solid state, you add thermal energy. The particles move more and more quickly, and melting occurs. As you add thermal energy to the liquid, vaporization will finally occur. Look at the middle of the sheet at the temperature where these changes happen. For water, the boiling and condensation point of water is 100 degrees Celsius or 212 degrees Fahrenheit. The melting and freezing point of water is 0 degrees Celsius or 32 degrees Fahrenheit. 
The difference is whether thermal energy is entering or leaving the water as to which phase change is occurring. On the right side, you see the two additional phase changes. Deposition is gas to solid skipping the liquid state, shown by this video of frost formation. Sublimation is solid to gas, skipping the liquid state, shown by this video of iodine crystals. And there's your review. Please color and enhance the sheet, adhere it to the next blank page in your notebook.